Elaine Chow is no stranger to politics. She served U.S. President George H.W. Bush as Deputy Secretary of Transportation and President George W. Bush as his Secretary of Labor. Four years ago, she also campaigned for former Republican presidential candidate Mitt Romney. She spoke to CCTV America at that year's Republican National Convention. I believed in limited government. And I believed in lower taxes. I believed in quality education. In recent years, Chow has leaned heavily on her Chinese heritage, working with her philanthropist father to build schools in China and to promote educational exchanges between American and Chinese students. The U.S.-China relations is one of the most important bilateral relationships in the world today. Like China, the U.S. is poised to make major investments in its infrastructure. Donald Trump has pledged to spend $1 trillion to build new roads, bridges and airports. A Secretary Chow would likely play a key role in getting that spending approved by lawmakers. That could put her at odds with her husband, Mitch McConnell. He is the Republican leader in the U.S. Senate and has put other issues well ahead of infrastructure on the Senate priority list. While it is unclear how much of Trump's proposed funding would come from the federal budget, McConnell is a well-known obstacle to increased government spending. But in choosing Chow to be his chief promoter on infrastructure spending, Trump could get leverage over reluctant Republicans, including McConnell. And infrastructure spending is a key area of agreement between Trump and Democrats in Congress. The next U.S. Secretary of Transportation may need to work closer, though, with Democrats to address other issues, too, like how and where to deploy commercial drones and how to regulate the use of self-driving cars on U.S. roads. Jessica Stone, Washington.